Aaron, what did you see from Hap today? It came out really crisp. Um, that first inning was really efficient. Um, and, uh, you know, gave up the home run to Garver, you know, kind of that Yankee Stadium one, uh, which got them going a little bit. And then just a couple things didn't quite go his way. Um, you know, maybe with a huge catch to kind of pr preserve it a little bit. But overall, I thought he threw the ball okay. But, you know, a couple things that didn't really go his way, couldn't quite get him through the six there. Do you think that one to Crone was mislocation? I'd have to go back and look at it. It looked like a two-seamer that that stayed up enough for him. Um, uh, but I didn't. I haven't watched it back yet. It looked like it was elevated enough when he went with that two-seam. What's your overall assessment of Miguel Andujar in his first game back? Yeah, first game back. Um, good to have him back, obviously. Obviously, a couple misplays in the field. Um, bounced back and made a couple good plays out there, but that's just something we're going to have to continue to, to, to grind through. Um, you know, was able to get a hit, and, you know, I thought had some decent at-bats today. Worked the walk the first time up, so good to have him back and, and hopefully just keep moving forward with it. And do you have an update on Paxton? Yeah, so Paxton obviously on the IL, um, <clears throat> he's just got some inflammation in there. Uh, <clears throat> got a cortisone shot, uh, I think before the game um, or during the game, whenever the doctor got here after I saw you guys. Um, so he'll be shut down for five days, and then from that point we'll see. We start throwing, hopefully it's something that's, that's fairly short, uh, but we'll see how, how he responds. Just to clarify, five to seven days. Five to seven days, sorry. Dan. What's your plan for his uh, spot in the rotation for now? Right, so <clears throat> it'll obviously probably be Luizaga. Uh, we'll just figure out if we want to insert him in his slot in that Wednesday slot. He's scheduled to actually throw tomorrow in uh, AAA. Um, we'll probably change that whether we want to have him throw short whether we want to have him throw aside whether we want to insert him at some point but that's something we'll talk through but right now i would expect him to just slot in where where james was and with andrew hart did you see him it looked like he was tentative on some of the throws even the the accurate ones did you see anything different from him no even? no um i didn't see that you know i, I thought it's you know on the throw to second where he threw it away it, you know his footwork got away from him a little bit there kind of off the wrong foot and the angle but no i didn't see i didn't feel like he was tentative no who else joe aaron uh do you get the feeling that this is the 2019 yankees you'll get one back you'll lose one this is just the way it's going to go for your team um no i'd say that's how it's been so far but uh hopefully it turns into getting more back um and that and that's what we believe will happen over time um but as it is right now, um, guys continue to, to to grind away at it and, and find a way, and that's what we, we need to continue to do, knowing that, you know, over time we're going to continue to get guys back. Damn. Hap's numbers are pretty uh, starkly different home and away. Is Do you see anything to that, or is that just the way it, that it's gone? <clears throat> um, I, I think it's a little the way it's gone. You know, Garver hits the two-run homer. That's, you know, probably not a homer a lot of other places. Um, you know, even the one Cameron took back's not, you know, that's a fly ball. So, you know, especially when we're talking just a month into the season, those are things that kind of can catch you a little bit and skew some things a little bit. But, no, nothing that I'm seeing. Other, You know, he got going a little bit where he started to lock it in and had two good ones on the road in a row. But, no, I don't think there's any correlation to home home away. Uh, in the back here. If you can. Aaron, you know, Miguel's first game of the two hours, will you try to get him back out there on third the next few days, or will you put get Gio back out there and have Miguel DH? The next few yeah i mean it, it's he'll he'll mix in in that kind of fold the way we are right now uh there's probably more dh um games you know with with the day game after the night game and wanting to get gary back in there you know that's the dh slot there now these next couple of days probably a chance to get geo back in there at third and and maybe can slot in at the dh but that'll be something that's daily that we'll just kind of look at you know what lines up the best 
Uh, no, you mean as far as shoulder stuff? No, I mean, I thought it was a footwork stuff. You know, obviously missed the first ground ball to him. Um, and then on the throw to second, I don't think it was shoulder related. I think he got his footwork got away from him. And then, you know, you're off the wrong foot from down under. It makes it a tough play. Chris, just curious, when did Barrett get here today? Barrett was, um, when did? I don't know. He, he, I, I met him actually right, right before the game. Um, so uh, it was probably around 12 o'clock when I first saw him, maybe okay. even later.